So, you know, unless you've been living under a rock, you may have heard something about these text messages. A, a text in particular from Hunter Biden that was discovered, and you know, the House committee has come forward with this, and it has been released into the public, and it really does kind of suggest something that doesn't feel right, right? That doesn't seem right. Because in this text, and I'll show it to you in, in just a second, you'll see what I mean. In this text, you basically see Hunter Biden sort of insinuating to his Chinese business associate or whatever you'd want to call him. The guy actually was a member of the CCP and also had a business associate himself that was effectively running the uh, intel operation for all of China. So that gives you an idea of, of the caliber of people that Hunter Biden was corresponding with. And he's pressuring the guy to give him some money. And he's like, you know, if you don't give it, well, there's going to be hell to pay. So this is coming back to haunt him in a really big way. Take a look at Excuse me? <laughs> Seriously? Hunter Biden, you send in a text like that? And by the way, apparently he wasn't kidding. Because the Washington Free Beacon is reporting that there is some metadata showing a picture of Hunter Biden there at his dad's Delaware home, apparently standing with some family members by a Corvette, on the exact day that that text was sent. We're talking about what... Uh, summer in 2017. So this is not looking very good. And what's amazing is that fortunately, even the White House press corps seems to be understanding that this is not looking very good. Amazing last night. You know, everybody was so consumed, which is why we had to talk about that, so consumed with the sub story that it sucked all the oxygen out of the airwaves, right? It was all the focus, of course, yesterday, and we got the devastating news that the five souls on board had passed away. Yet, somehow, the, the media just ignored this whole thing, right? They ignored the text, and in fact, the only mainstream media publication to talk about it last night on the evening news would have been actually NBC. Hey everyone, Trish Regan here. If you enjoyed that clip, please do me the favor of subscribing to the channel. Just hit that little subscribe button right over there. Did I do that right? Uh, not quite, but you know where it is. Subscribe to the channel, hit the bell so that you get the alerts, and I'll see you back on the show.